everyone thought just Marlo could dance around here. <laughs> Hi everyone, I'm Callie, this is Lori, and Hi. we are very excited you're with us this evening. We have the coolest way for you to transfer all of your favorite videos, you know, the cherished videos that are probably sitting on a tape that's becoming terribly degraded and probably will, like that, be ready to break and never be to, see, to be seen again. What this is, it's Protus, and it's a DVD recorder. We at HSN, we actually give you the 15 blank discs, discs to get started, and you can transfer any footage you have from even a camcorder, VHRs or VHS tapes, um, digital cameras, USB storage devices, all of them, even VCRs, um, to a disc, or you can transfer any of those formats to a USB flash drive or an SD card. So now there are more options than ever before. It used to be just transferring from a tape to a disc. Now you can transfer mm -hmm. to and fro. It's really an amazing value to do this because you know what? Saving one precious family video will pay for itself first time out. And it's really easy to use. Lori Leland stays with me to, to go through the fun details. So easy. And here's what we love about the Protus. This is a standalone unit. So Good you're going to plug into this anything that you want, any of your sources. So it could be your VCR, could be your DVR, could be your camcorders. Are you ho hoarding and holding on to old camcorders that have video footage on them because you have no way to figure out how to get that footage off of that camcorder? Now the Protus is your answer. So all you're doing is plugging in any of those devices. You don't need a computer. You don't need a monitor for this because right here on this great little standalone device is a nearly three inch screen. So you can see what I'm playing on my VCR right now, right here next to this, that's plugged into this, is playing right here on the screen of my Protus. So it really makes it convenient and easy way for you to be able to digitize in your own home. And think about this, you know, Callie just mentioned it. We have tons and tons of VHS tapes. They're sitting around our homes, degrading by the moment. No one's enjoying these. When is the last time you popped well, in a tape? who has a VHS or a VCR well, to even play those it. things anymore? And I'm glad you said that because the final manufacturing yeah. facility that made VHS um, in players the, in, the world in the world is, is now gone. defunct. It's done, it is shut down. So here's what I had to do. I had to go to a thrift shop and I had to buy one. It was only $5, but it worked, and this is it, and it's on its last leg. So <laughs> I am telling you, I am breathing a sigh of relief knowing that I've taken all of my family memories I know, I am too. and made them digital. And I did it with a different model that we had a couple years back, mm -hmm. and it, it felt so good to do it. What I like oh, about this one best. compared to the one that I had, the one I had was kind of complicated. I had to like finalize, and if you forgot to finalize, the you know the discs right. are empty. I love that you can see, you can see what it. you're recording, and you can see that it's actually doing the job. You can see it, and there's a big red button right here. So I'm watching the video right here in real time. I simply press the button right here. It automatically starts to record the video footage. It'll automatically stop when the video footage stops or when you press the stop button, and then it burns onto the disc. The little disc slides right in here. You get 15 of them to get you started, and it is such a simple and easy process. So you can walk away. You can go have a cup of coffee, come back a little bit later, and now all of your stuff will be digitized. So I'm gonna go ahead and press stop here. It is now burning that little clip of video footage right onto that disc. But Kelly made a great point. This is the most versatile digitization device we've yep. ever offered. Because you don't have to have a disc. What if you don't wanna burn it onto a disc? You don't have to, no. What if you wanna take your family memories from VHS tape and put them on a USB drive? You can. You can do that. What if you wanna take any of your family memories and put them onto a, a, you can do that an too. SD card? You can do that as and well. If you want to take it from an SD card to put it over on a flash drive, you can do that too. You can convert anything into anything. So this is your all-purpose, do-it-all, complete conversion system. You can see why right this is a customer pick. Hand. Yeah, it really all, is so the, awesome. It's so, so effective, this is done. so easy. Look, it's done? It's done. Wow, So it just that. popped that the disc right out, and that is literally all there is to it. I'll take you through the menus in just a moment and okay. just show you how easy this and is. And let me remind you guys, you are saving $40 by getting it today. This is also something, for this hour only, we added a fifth flex. So it's only 20, I think 7.99 to get this delivered and there's free shipping. You have a month. You have some time to play with it before you even decide because it should be easy or you're not gonna wanna do it. This one from Protus is the easiest one we've ever offered. It's one touch and, and Lori's mm -hmm. gonna actually show you. And I love the fact that it's got the nice screen so you can see what's going on at the same time. Exactly, and this is not only your burner, it's also your player. Yes. So this has HDMI out on it right here. A lot of us have those HDMI cables around our homes. You can take your Protus, and by the way, this was manufactured in one of the top manufacturing facilities 
facilities for consumer electronics in the world. 16 year um, history with this manufacturing facility. So they do a great job with this. But you're gonna be able to plug this in with an HDMI cable to any of your big screen TVs. So this is a DVD player and it's a DVD burner all in one sleek compact little unit. The really nice thing too is I made this. <laughs> this is my husband when he was two years old. It's so cute. I have a two year old baby son, right? So I want my baby to be able to see what my husband looked like when he was young. But this tape was starting to wear. Do you know that this is up converting these family memories from over 38 years ago to 1080p? So it's oh, making it right. as good as possible. So it's taking what, I mean, I don't know how old your husband is, Ken, but you know, he's he's been around for a couple decades. Yeah, this is 38 year old footage. Okay. So there you go. Okay, so he's 40. Yeah. There you go. I'm a mathematician too. You just didn't realize it, did you? You are a whiz. And I was just trying to avoid saying it in case he was watching. Oh, yes, oh 40. to be 40 again for the love. No, it's so great though uh, that you've got that to share. I mean, sure. wow. That's incredible. And if you. If that tape stayed in a garage or in a box in a basement or in an attic. Who's enjoying that? No exactly. one is even looking at it. And, in, and eventually it's gonna be absolutely impossible. It, there's gonna be nothing to be seen. It'll, it'll be, be empty. destroyed. Yeah, it'll be completely destroyed. So look at this. Aww. With Protus now, we've made everything digital. You can burn it onto that disc, put it onto a USB, put it onto an SD card, and now you can put it on social media. Now you can put it on YouTube. Now you can enjoy it on Facebook. Put it up for Throwback Thursday. Now, that video that I love to torture my husband with from 38 years ago. The cutest thing ever. Is on my cell phone. <gasps> it's on my tablet. Look at him eating cheese. He looks so much like our little baby boy. <laughs> it's so crazy. But if I had left let these family memories slip away, I would have never forgiven myself. I know, I know. And that so is a great sad. point, Lori. I'm just gonna, I have to go there for a minute because it is your responsibility to carry on the family legacy. Truly. It is. There's only, you know, not, a, not somebody's probably not gonna show up and just offer to do this for you. Having the right tool, you can do it. You will be forever grateful that you did. And it's not complicated. I have to remind you too, if you're just tuning in, you can record video, music, photos without a PC with this. This is something that will record from a multitude of sources. Let's go through them. VCRs, DVD players, mm -hmm. camcorders, digital cameras, USB storage devices. It records from USB, USB, AV input, SD memory cards onto discs or onto either the USB or the SD memory card. So lots of versatility and options with so this. So much, absolutely. So I walked up to it with a camera, camcorder, you said it, VCR, DVR. Maybe you have some of your favorite TV shows. Yeah. I know my baby watches some educational shows. Good. They're on my DVR. I don't wanna have to buy the box sets. Plug in the Protus, and now you can burn those discs, or, or now you can put it on a USB drive, whatever you wanna do. Use this as a home-based business. Put an ad on Craigslist and say, I digitize tapes and undercut the competition by just a few dollars, and this will pay for itself. So look at this. I I plugged in one of my favorite uh, Sony cameras. If you have memory stuck on cameras, stuck on old camcorders that you may be hoarding because you have no idea how to get that footage off, all you do is plug it in. With Anything with AV out, you're gonna be able to plug right into the side of the Protus. You simply touch the one big red button and this is gonna go to work to automatically start burning that content onto your source. And again, it could be the disc. We are providing 15 oh. discs to get started. Yeah, well, it could be only... USB or SD cards as well. We are counting backwards. I hate that when that happens because that means it's getting close to selling out. You have nine minutes. Oh, wow. Actually, yeah, nine minutes because five flex is only for this hour. But with 900 left, that's very few. We've sold over 5,000. I'm just encouraging you guys not to put this off anymore if right. you have. Because, and I get it because it's like, oh, another job. But it's a fun job. It I is did this fun. probably seven years ago. And I'm telling you. It's freeing, isn't it's, it? You it just is. feel like you've done and the right relieving. thing by your family. Because I, yeah. you know, my son is 21 years old. Right. And so the footage I have of him was on those little mini DV tapes and a lot of other bigger formats. I've transferred, so I've got them forever. Well, and if you think about some of the VHS tapes you have, a lot of your past relatives probably converted some of these from eight millimeters, super eight. So they've kept these medias going. Now we're down to VHS. You need to transfer it onto something that you can continue to pass on. That will be that good will still forever. Be around. That yeah. won't degrade, that won't tear, that won't, you know, break. Exactly. Discs won't, SD cards won't, USB flash drives won't. You've got all three formats at your disposal with the Protus unit right here. Five, exactly. four, five, sorry, four, eight, zero, five, four, six, twenty-seven, ninety-nine to get it home and try it. But we do have 900 left, several hundred people ordering. You could be ordering other things, but it is really getting down to the wire. So it's something definitely to, to put in your basket, check it out. You've got a month to play with it. And Lori, again, it is super easy. Super easy. So look at the little menu 
menu. It just said, what do you want to burn onto? It knows my source is the AVN. So it's coming in from my VCR. Do I want to burn it onto that USB drive? Yes, I do. All I do is touch that button right like that. And it says, it'll tell me if it's ready. I have to actually put in one that's got a little space on it, I think. But it's so simple and easy to use. It gives you all of the instructions and all of the information right there. So if I want to go in and I want to burn it onto a disc, I can do that. If I want to put it on my memory card, I can do that. It's very, very simple. It's all spelled out for you. And it just guides you through the entire process. That's what we love about the Protus. Again, a great little standalone. You don't need to have a computer for this. You don't need a monitor for this. You're getting this nearly three inch screen right here, which makes it so simple and easy for you to be able to use and maneuver. And I love the fact too, that um, really it works with everything. So you can plug in your old camcorders. You can plug yeah. in your cameras. You can plug in your yeah. DVRs. You can right plug into in the your unit. VCRs. By the way, because VCRs aren't being manufactured anymore, people are going to catch on and it's going to, they're going to start going sky high to get one. So if you need to get one, go to the thrift shop, see <laughs> if you can grab one for five bucks like I did, because this may be your last chance to digitize your family memories or there won't be a way to play these anymore. Boy, it makes one, me feel old. Oh, but it's just know, the way right? it is. Well, they always, there's always a transition to format yeah. and now it's going to be digital, but it's easier because now we can email those files. It's so Instead true. Instead of having something in hand, now you'll have a way to share it more easily. And I get that a lot of us, like, I feel attached to some of my VHS tapes, or I, I guess I did, because I don't even have any anymore. Right. I don't know why. I guess it's because it was what was familiar for right. so many years. So sometimes technology can freak us out and make us go, ah, I don't know. But this is so user-friendly and so the way that, you know, life is now. And if you want to preserve any of the memories that are sitting on a tape that's just going to get worse before, well, it's, it's going to get worse and then it's going to be gone is essentially the reality. Get something that you can transfer and convert to a disc or a USB drive or an SD card. All formats, and you can do it interchangeably. You could go from a USB to a disc. You could go from an SD to a disc. You could go from a disc to an SD. I mean, anything, to every, anything. It's very friendly with each other. A clock on the screen, and final, final couple of hundred available. You do get all the discs, and you get the cables included as well. It's a uh, four eight zero five four six. And then you were talking about you had gotten rid of yours, so yep. that's great. Think about this amount of space that these VHS tapes are taking up in our homes. Do you have them in a bin? Are they in the attic? Attic is not good because nope. it's usually very, very hot or very, very cold depending on the season. And basements aren't good because pipes break. Exactly <laughs> right. And they, they could get flooded. That's not a good idea. So grab your tapes right now today. Grab this Protus and digitize all these family memories. Instead of having to store all of this, all I do is I put my Protus in data mode. And that simply means when I go to burn a disc, I can continue to add footage onto that disc until it's full. And then this oh, has excellent. universal compatibility. So you're going to be able to take this to pretty much any computer or any DVD player and be able to play back all of those family memories. Excellent. But now you can get rid of all of this. Instead, I have this one disc that used to be all of this. So <laughs> it takes up a lot less space in your home. And then if you've ever seen those services, they want to charge $25 a tape. Have you seen the new boxes? They want mm. you to put all your fam family memories in a box and then mail it. No, thanks. Yeah, that makes me really nervous. Really? Like, never. I would never do that. Well, like, and then you pay oh. 100 and something for the one box, but then you have another whole box full. You have to pay I'm another not, $100. I'm not letting anybody else have my boxes. Exactly. I mean, seriously, exactly. that is like it's no scary. chance. Um, with everybody on the phones, my producer is updating. We have 400 left. 400 final available at this incredible value, too. Plus, the fifth flex is only for the next, I don't know, couple of minutes until they sell out. We'll definitely honor even if you're ordering as you transition to the next hour, it was supposed to be a this hour only five flex option, free shipping to your door, and it does come with the 15 discs, so you're set to go right out of the mm -hmm. gate. If you prefer SD cards or USB flash drives, it works with those as well. Thank you for your orders on this, and I know our, our time is almost up. We have another hour of electronics, but don't even don't even think about waiting on this one if you're interested, because it will be selling out in this show. Oh my gosh, so popular, mm -hmm. always wildly popular. And like I said, if you want that great home-based business, we hear people that call into the show all the time and say, yeah, I put an ad on Craigslist. And they paid for it in no time yeah, at all. Yeah, exactly. You want to work from home, you want to do some, you know, help out some friends doing some digitization. This is a very simple and easy way to do it. And again, anything plugs in here, AV out, anything with an AV out, you can plug in. So it could be the old camcorders, old cameras. It could be your VHR, it could be, or your VCR, I should say, your DVR. All of those devices plug right in. 
you have a nearly three inch screen right here so you're able to see when you play that content back. So you don't need a monitor for this. You don't have to plug it into a computer. There's no computer needed. When you're ready to burn, all you do is touch that one big red button right there. This automatically starts burning onto a disc or you can specify to put it onto the USB drive or the SD cards, whatever it is you wanna use, you're gonna be able to burn onto any of those. When you're done, you simply press stop and it's, it'll pop out the media if it's the disc and it'll let you know on the screen when it's finished. It's just the simplest, easiest thing. Universal compatibility here, so this should play in pretty much every device out there and it's your player as well. So if you want a great little portable DVD player, use this with an HDMI cable that you have around your How house. How cool is that? And plug it right into your TV and up converting to 10 80p high definition, making your old lost family memories look better than they probably than looked they in did. the first.